They do everything together, and it's been that way from the minute they were born. In middle school, the straight-A students and identical twins decided to become doctors. Kelly and Kayla Bingham even got into the same med school, the Medical University of South Carolina. They excelled right up to their second year final exam. And left thinking everything had gone incredibly well, and we're very excited to start our third year of medical school. But rather than the stellar grade they expected, they were both accused of cheating. We thought this is absurd and thought it would be easily cleared up. The cheating accusations came about when test proctors found that the twins had answered 296 out of 307 questions in a similar way. Cheating was thought to be the only reasonable explanation. Did you cheat? Absolutely not. <laughs> no. The sisters say they were immediately treated like pariahs by their fellow students. It was a complete isolation from individuals that we had been friends with for years. We were disinvited from several weddings. It was probably one of the lowest points of our entire lives. They said they had no choice but to leave the school. What was it like to have that just taken away? Oh, it was awful. It's devastating. But the sisters fought back. They sued the school for defamation. And they put forward a very plausible explanation for how they scored so close to each other. First, they testified that they always test alike. Second, they always study together, too. Our exams have always been within a percentage point of each other. Scoring similarly is not the you know, abnormality, it is, it is our normal. Look, they scored exactly the same on the SATs. Six years later, Kayla and Kelly have finally won their battle. A jury found in their favor and awarded the twins $1.5 million. What would you say to one another now? I'm really proud oh, of you. I was gonna say the, I was gonna say the same thing. <laughs>